Rotator cuff degeneration is a common cause of shoulder pain and functional limitations in older adults. Several intrinsic and extrinsic factors have been implicated, including microvascular changes, altered collagen metabolism, diabetes, and overuse. Studies have found that those who have siblings with rotator cuff degeneration are at five times greater risk of having the same issue, which suggests that genetics plays a role in causing rotator cuff degeneration. However, individuals with spouses reporting rotator cuff degeneration were also shown to be at greater risk, suggesting that environmental factors may also play a role. To determine how much genetic factors contribute to rotator cuff degeneration when compared to the environment, a group of Italian researchers performed a study evaluating rotator cuff health in twins. They recruited 33 pairs of twins between the ages of 50 and 75 years. 17 pairs were monozygotic twins and 16 pairs were dizygotic twins. The dominant shoulder was assessed with magnetic resonance imaging scans and was scored based on the Sugaya classification system. Results showed that the environment plays a much greater role on rotator cuff degeneration than genetics. Although genetics only accounted for 18% of rotator cuff degeneration, environmental factors were responsible for over 80% of the degeneration process, with the shared environment accounting for 44% and the unique environment accounting for 38%. In conclusion, the findings indicate that environmental factors rather than genetics may have a greater impact on rotator cuff degeneration. However, these findings are only partial to the effects of shared and unique environments.